Yeah, so it's been a good couple months, a good couple major finishes as of late, and uh, really just working on, on the prep for, for Valhalla. I played well last week at the WGC, had a good finish there, so really just working on, uh, like I said, the prep that I, I've done at the previous majors to, to really make sure I'm ready to, to go once Thursday comes around. Well, I've, I've gone into all the majors this year in a similar position, played the week per before, uh, went through kind of a checklist and was able to, to see where I stood mentally and physically the week before, where my game was, and to kind of go through there and, and get everything worked out the week before. That way I went into the week of the major prepared with my game, prepared mentally, uh, just had to make sure I was rested and ready to tee it up on Thursday. Yeah, it is, it is really busy. Uh, June, July, August, and into September, it's, it's a very busy time. Um, I, I took three weeks off prior to going over to the Scottish Open the week before the British Open, so I was able to get some rest then. And um, looking forward to this week, and I have another week off, and then into the playoffs. So busy stretch, but definitely making sure I take the right time off. Uh, a win here would be icing on top of the cake. Uh, it's been a great year so far. Obviously some great finishes in the majors this year and put ourselves in position to be in contention at every major. So I'm definitely pleased with where I'm at. Um, I'm a lock on the Ryder Cup team, so definitely a special year already, and this will just be icing on top. Uh, I enjoyed it. Uh, I got to play all the holes, uh, played a few with, with Adam as well, and had a good time out there. So it's, it looks like it's fairly straightforward. Uh, definitely, definitely want to be playing out of the short grass. The fairways are fairly generous in, in a lot of areas. So. Um, but it definitely makes a difference when you're able to play out short grass and able to attack the golf course from there. Yeah, so you know, playing against Martin, final group of the U.S. Open was a good time. We had a, we had a good, good fun there. Um, you know, Adam's a good buddy, and you know, playing against those guys, it's always fun playing against guys when they're when they're playing well. And Adam's had a, obviously a great year. Martin's been playing well. Uh, definitely looking forward to against, playing against Martin at the Ryder Cup later in the year. So uh, I feel like we've got some some good guys with Mercedes. We've got some good ambassadors playing well right now. Yeah, really looking forward to the Ryder Cup. Uh, I've never played at Glen Eagles, haven't been there, but uh, definitely, definitely looking forward to it. It's going to be a fun, fun week up there, and uh, looking forward to spending some time with the team. Yeah, yeah. 2016 is a little ways to look ahead, but uh, being able to play on, play in the Olympics, playing for the country would be would be awesome. Um, I guess it was never really a dream, just because golf was never in the Olympics. So it's maybe. Uh, a pretty current dream now to, to have a chance to represent your country. I know always watching the Olympics was always cool and being able to see you know athletes go out and represent their country and have a chance to win a gold medal and now with golf being in there we have a chance to do that so it'd be, be special to be a part of the Olympic team.